Okay, and we're back. Now we're on Highway 47. No, this is Highway 79. Sorry. <laughs> I'm lost. That's the way I drive. I just don't know where I live. Okay, this is Highway 79. Which goes north from Highway 70. Highway 70 runs, for the most part, across the nation from Pennsylvania all the way through the middle of the United States, through St. Louis, and uh, out to Denver, Colorado. That's about where it dies. That's nice. Well, yeah, you know what I mean. Now, what we're about to show you is all this farmland out here. Because of the flooding, we have quite a bit of uh, water and uh, standing in the fields. So, yeah, we're parallel to the Missouri River, uh, where it comes down uh, from the northwest, and it merges with the Mississippi right above St. Charles, where the last video where we indicated. So this area right here is where the convergence is of the two great rivers merging. And with all the water that we have up north, uh, oh, by the way, that's a, that's a shit wet. <laughs> that's what we got the windows up. Yeah, because it smells it's, awful uh, around it, here. Yeah, it's, uh, it'll make you want to get some, uh, yeah. some oh. cheese bread and go dip it. I'm telling you, Nasty. it's good stuff. It is good stuff. Anyway, so the two rivers converge, and with all of the uh, snow melt that we have, and today that they have more snow up in Minnesota. I think, yes. Yeah, Minnesota got snow again. Are you kidding me? So, um, so we'll have continual melt. We're having rain now, and we're supposed to get a lot of rain again, so it's not going to help anything. Uh, so the river is right out there to the right, where Sue's pointing. Uh, Just behind those tr that tree line. Yeah, way out there behind the tree line, there's where the river is. So, oh, by the way, we want to say hi to uh, all of our mates in Australia. That's why we're making this. Uh, uh, all of our Polkin friends. Uh, Hex Hextol. Sue Hextol. Sonia. Joanne. We love you guys. We miss you. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Go, go hug a Corolla for me. <laughs> Throw a ship on the barbie. Okay, check oh, this Lord. out. Check okay. this out. Here it comes. This Here it comes. This water is coming all the way up into the side farms. And right here, this highway we're on is about roughly a mile and a half off the river. So this is, it's coming in a long way. Yeah. And uh, the highway here during the year, sometimes in really, really bad flooding stages, you'll flood it out. It'll come up and go over this highway, which would be about... You can see how close it is yeah, right now. Look how close feet. it is to the highway right 12 now. 12 feet above. So uh, So we're barely getting to drive on it right now. Pretty soon, if it continues to, to rain like it is, uh, it, it may cover the road and they might have to close it. So. We'll have to go the long way around to get home. Uh, this is a very popular road uh, on weekends for our Harley friends. Harleys will be seen going up and down this uh, highway to go to like Hannibal, which is where Mark Twain uh, was born and uh, wrote his famous book. Hannibal, Missouri. Hannibal, Missouri. Uh, also, just in between us and Hannibal is uh, one of Sue's family's towns called Louisiana, Missouri. And Bowling Green? And Bowling Green. Sue's family is the Basie family, B-A-S-Y-E. They came from Bowling Green, Kentucky. Uh, moved up here to Missouri established Bowling Green, Missouri, and, uh... Also Louisiana, Missouri. Oh, yeah. Which was named after one of my ancestors, Louisiana Basie. So, history... What else, is, what else is Louisiana known for? Uh... Come on. I don't know. Momo. Oh, the, God. The 
Bigfoot, a Sasquatch. Oh, here's more flooding. The Missouri Monster. That road is not impassable. Yeah. So Craig loves to talk about his Momo and his... Because I believe in Sasquatch. I believe in Bigfoot. Look at those guys. They have a little hunting thing back there, and that uh, Suburban is like... Submerged. He's not going to get to it. <laughs> you know. Oh, man. He's up shit creek without a paddle. There's this little, um, oh, they got it. Oh, did we pass it? No, not yet. It's coming up. Oh, look at this. It's gotten worse over here. Oh, yeah, it's getting worse. This is all this. Oh, one. man. This is bad. It's coming up higher over here. Yeah, so it's getting higher. It's higher than it was this morning when we left. We're coming home from the, the hospital. My, uh, uh, the VA, Veterans Administration. It's a military hospital, which sucks. But anyway, they have uh, appointments down there all the time. So if you can look real close, way out there to the right, uh, up on stilts, that is a hunting uh Post. Yeah. It's a blind. It's a blind. A they call that blind. a hunting blind. Yeah, the guys crawl up and, and uh, shoot deer. Hopefully they don't shoot towards the highway. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. There's another one out there to the right next to that tree. You see that tree? See the tree right there? Yeah, there's another blind out there. Yeah, I have to zoom in. Yeah. Of course, I don't know how to zoom, so. Okay. Have fun. <laughs> yeah, man, it's coming up. It's going to be bad for the crops. Well, actually, this is good for the crops. It's good? This is actually good for the crops. They like it when the the, uh, the Missouri overflows because there are nutrients and uh, different types of... Uh, minerals? Minerals and, and everything that comes out of the, the river that helps to regenerate a lot of the soil that is that is is for the plants and everything that they use for the, the, the fields. So so that's actually good. They like it when it floods. So it's not bad. bad in bad. essence, what the wife's trying to say is fish shit is good for it. It's very good. It's good for the fields. It's good yeah. for the plants. So if as long as it's a mild, you know, nobody gets hurt type flooding and it's and that kind of stuff, they say it's actually very good for the soil. So, a lot of the houses out there to your right, um, we're coming up on Quiver River. Oh, look at this! This is a river that has definitely gone over. Way over. Way over. Way it's up. It's up over, over. It's up over twelve foot here. Yeah, this is like supposed to be a small river, and it's all over, and it's gotten all over into the small town of Moscow Mills. Yeah, we're coming up At on Moscow Old Mills. Uh, a lot of these houses way off to the right, which is to our east. Um, a lot of these guys build their houses on stilts. Because they know it's going to be. You know, so they, they'll, they'll build some garages below or some place to park their car, but you got to go up like two stories to get into the house. And uh, they'll have boats. Uh, you know, I don't, I don't know what, uh, I don't know what, you know, Dundee calls his boats over there. I don't know. What do you guys call them? Probably you know, boats, honey. Boats? Really? I would imagine well, they we call, call their boats they call boats. They call John boats over here. John boats? Yes. Kind of like a... A flat boat? Yeah, yeah. It's like a okay. redneck boat or a, or a, a, a bogan skiff. Oh, I don't have mercy. Yeah, I'm trying to make up stuff. <laughs> I'm trying to be humorous. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is a long video. <laughs> this is a long video. I hope you guys get enjoyment out of this because, you know. They're drifting off. I'm, right sport, I'm sporting a chubby over it. I think I'm a rock star. Jeez. Yeah. yeah. Here's oh, some more of the river. Up. Oh, yeah. We're getting closer to the oh, river. And this is right by the railroad tracks. So. Yeah. Shoot. I kind of missed it. It's over the this little uh, bank. That of course that they have the bank there so that it won't yeah, go man, up. Back here. But if you kind of see over the hump there, 
there is a river right right beyond the uh, the cranes over there the sand and the uh, rock quarry you'll see the the river right beyond there hold this up that would be horrible. Uh, the river were to rise so high that the, the railroad would be uh, shut off. You want to say anything else, baby? Oh, let's see. Let's see if I can say anything intelligent. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it. I, we just wanted to show you uh, good old fashioned flooding in Missouri because. We're so uh, used to it over here. We have that quite often. Yeah, and Sonia, I'm sorry it took me so long to put this together, but I know you wanted to show your husband uh, where you visited. And uh, this is on the way. Ooh, it's real good out there. I can see it too. I want to get up over this hill and see if you can see it. Yeah, let's see. Way up. That's the river. That is the river. It's going to be hard with my phone. I wish I had a better uh, way to to uh, show this to you because, of course, I don't have great uh, video equipment. But yeah, and you were out in the uh, the farmland. It's exciting. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, and we'll send you pictures of the house when we get home. We got a ways to get there. But this is it. Farmland in Missouri. Yeah. And my and husband, Craig. Marine Corps. I'm not in the Navy, Hex. I'm not Navy. All right? <laughs> Let's get this shit straight. And my name is Sue, and I don't look really good. I'm having a bad hair day, so I'm not getting on the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's my wife. The vain one. Vain. Vain. No. Don't look good. Don't put me on camera. I'm old. Don't take my picture. I've got my red shoes on. <laughs> There's going to be a house falling on me. Here, then I'll show. Hi. There you go. There there's, you are. there's not your day. I don't even know if you can even see because I just turned it around and I'm not, I don't know if I, I'm showing up in the video or not. Oh, but that's us. There's my little window liquor. <laughs> All right. Well, Bye. we're going to sign out for now, guys. We love you. Uh, we miss you. Friends forever. Take care. Bye.